right so another crypto company news of billions of dollars links are put down below for what i'm talking about crypto lender genesis files for bankruptcy now funny thing is this news um, was sent to me by um, a guy who he kind of follows my content and uh, he and i don't agree on everything but uh, he's a smart guy smart educated dynamic personality who has he's young huh, by the way pretty young i'll not give you specifics about him because confidentiality he's not my client he has not paid me for my service but i enjoy chatting with him because he's really really smart uh he sent me this because uh, you know he was into crypto he still is he made uh, how much did he make he made around 3 or 4 million whatever in crypto but he had taken a gamble and remember this is not uh, uh, investment advice i'm telling because youtube needs a disclaimer i'm not an expert i'm just a guy who's giving his opinions okay um so when he was you know in 18 19 that time he had borrowed money taken money and he kept playing around investing here and there and he took a loan then he took loan from his relatives which is not recommended but in his case it paid off he paid back the money and uh, then he kept reinvesting and obviously when the boom took place he made tons of money but i you know when i asked him how much did you lose he didn't give me a specific amount but he said i've lost on tops of a million okay so losing 1 million and making 3 4 or 5 million not bad not bad so so he sent me this uh, and we were just talking and it's it's funny that um, when people are making money nobody complains but when people are losing money they not only cry about it they not only get angry they take others to court like for example if i give money to someone and i'm making money thousands of dollars every day i'm not going to complain i will just say he's a number one guy he's the best guy in the world but i gave gave someone 1000 and i'm losing even if i lose 10 or 20 or 30 every day i'm not going to be very happy so the human beings they love greed as long as of their so same thing with this company genesis when <laughs> now that they have collapsed now everyone is gunning for them and they collapsed because they were linked to ftx you know that sam guy and he still says he's innocent and before that there was uh, uh, three arrows capital you remember if you see those videos how sure these people were how you know the educated ones the smart ones oh it's web 3.0 oh it's uh, these are uh, you know and people who are busy attacking even me your uneducated what naked guy roaming walking what the fuck do you know what the hell do you know whatever uh, who are you what do you know about blockchain i used to even have some goras who used to sit and uh, nicely send me uh, messages what what actually are your credentials what is your specialization by the way i am a blockchain expert crypto expert i have x amount of investments even our indians and pakistan who are based in uh, ue uh, they were telling me loy don't think you know everything i started when i started off i was only a sales guy earning 1000 dollars per month today i'm opening my fourth company fifth company you're still the same i've lost respect for you they vanished 
I've told you this before. So what happens see, in crypto, the problem is when one collapses, everyone's interlinked. All will collapse one by one. There was also this bank, I can't get the name, you can maybe comment down below. The bank that heavily invested in only crypto, heavily. Now they are asking for 4.5 billion dollars bailout. <sighs> when these guys are making money, everybody was enjoying. They, like this guy Sam, Sam Friedman or whatever. He sponsored Democrats, he sponsored Republicans. He greased them up. Now, anyone, is anyone going to catch the politicians? Is anyone going to take money back from them? You're crazy? They enjoyed, but now he's in trouble. So, it's, uh, I've told you so many times, when you're trying to reinvent the system, when you're trying to challenge the government, when you are putting your money into something you don't understand, by google.com you don't become an expert and when the human element greed is there emotional biases come to play and just like uh, you know how you play the game you give me one I give you one back one plus one give me five I give you five plus five ten ten plus ten so soon you start believing, soon you become my big fan, soon you become a guy who says, I believe this guy, this is the bit net, this is the bit finance, this is the bit this, bit that. Oh, what do you know, man, how much money I made? And one fine day, they ask you to put your life savings, everything, and you're sitting and waiting there to get double. And then they vanish. Gone, right? So now, this guy, this company, sorry, okay, not only they are going to crash, you remember this one, uh, uh, one is Genesis, one is Gemini, then is that uh, Wilkin, what, Winkel Voss, twins, you know the Facebook uh, twin brothers, which was on social network, that movie, they, <laughs> I think they have lost around, uh, what, uh, 900 million? Uh, something like that, can't get the exact. They have also lost millions and millions. So, Winkle was, yes, 900 million dollars. Okay, uh, that, mu that much of assets they have. If there is any... I've told you this is not an investment, man. This is just you put your money and wait for it to go 10x, 20x, 100x. You can't do anything with it. You just wait until it goes high, then you sell, pump and dump. I, when I recommended watching the thoughts of Nouriel Rubini, everyone was like, hey, wh what the hell does that guy know? Hey, that guy is still in power. He's still respected around the world. He's still, whatever he predicted came true. Where are all these cryptocurrency experts now? In fact, uh, the other day I was reading on Instagram, this guy predicted he'll go one Bitcoin, uh, 500 million. Ah, Kathy Wood, just Google search Kathy Wood. That female, when I criticized her, oh, everyone was jumping on her. Man, she's from the Ivy League. She has been the CEO. She's worth billions of dollars. You half-naked uh, Indian wannabe someone. What do you know? What happened to all her stocks? What happened to her company? It's bleeding red and she's giving such bull such total bullshit excuses as to why uh, she's right. It's total rubbish. See, what you do fail to understand is just because you have a college degree doesn't mean your intentions are good. Just because you have a big position, maybe like Elon Musk or someone, doesn't mean you're a saint. Come on, man. When will you learn? The rich will only get richer. See, eh, end of the day, Kathy Wood made billions of dollars. Uh, Elon Musk made billions of dollars. 
the people who created these coins made billions of dollars the ones who got in early and dumped it fast made hundreds of thousands of dollars but the people who believed and held on to these coins thinking it was a safe investment they suffered i even today i know there are a lot of people who will say yeah it is an investment yeah put your money where your mouth is and invest in all this no 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 you have to be smart here investment is not something you put and remove put and remove put and remove that's not investment that is gambling and when you cannot predict uh obviously you can't predict anything but at least in companies you have a you know there's a physical company but here what do you own man you just own some digital some you know bits of numbers on the internet and you believe oh i own something you own nothing you you put your actual money they always ask you give me your actual money for this token this nft this crypto game this crypto egg like logan paul this nonsense what happens so anyway will will can boss whatever his name is he also lose now finally sam friedman will get fried Anyway, in conclusion, I can tell you, my friend, uh, not friend, the guy who I chatted with, he made his money. Yes, he did lose his money, and does it pain him? Yes, of course. We don't like to lose even a penny, but we like to gain everything. So he only tells me, I wish I had withdrawn faster. But I can assure you, this one, this is not the end. There is still more to collapse. and in the end you will be just left with maybe just bitcoin and uh, ethereum but i can tell you ethereum also at some point will collapse i don't know i just have this gut feeling about ethereum just a gut feeling huh? not a financial thing i feel only bitcoin will remain in the end and those people who are holding it will be like ah oh, yeah i remember that's it once ethereum uh, collapses finished nobody will talk about all this bullshit anymore the only people will talk is maybe the governments and uh, the problem that cryptocurrency try to solve the power in the hands of people not the banking institutes or governments well the problem will not be solved and will continue as usual at least this generation next generation let's see Anyway, give me your thoughts in the comments below. Good, bad, ugly. Love to know. This is me signing off. Please take care.